Hello Elf owners, Francois and Laura here. We've had our Elf for a uh, week now. I'm just going to quickly run you through some basic settings. It's very easy, it's going to take less than a minute to finish this video. First thing you're going to want to do is set the time. Press these two buttons, adjust your time to local time, 8.44. Okay. Now when you have the little icon over there with a the little oven above the dot, this is pretty much in manual mode. Um, which means when you turn on the temperature and you set the mode, lights are going to come up, oven's going to heat, just like an old manual stove, right? I'm going to show you how to get this to start at a certain time, bake for a certain time, and shut off automatically. Very easy. You're going to hit this button, and you're going to set when to start in hours and minutes from the current time. So let's say I want to start at 9 a.m. I'm going to hit this button, and I'm going to go 16 minutes. 16 minutes. I'm going to hit my end and it's going to automatically calculate 9. And let's say I just want to bake 5 minutes. So there it is. It's set. Now what I do is I'll go let's say 200 or the recipe calls for 300 and I will just go with like top and bottom griddle. You can see now the lights are off. And what's going to happen is I can check in. I can say oh golly when did I say? Oh I'm going to press this button. It's in 16 minutes which is going to put me at 9 a.m. more or less and I can check my end time 9.05 and you can adjust this which is cool so let's say I'm like you know I don't want to do five minutes I want to do four minutes so I'll just drop this to 9.04 so what I'm going to do now is it's 8.45 I'm going to start at 8.47 I'm going to clock this down to two minutes and I'm going to end it at let's see say 8.45 I'm going to start in 2 minutes 8.47 I'm going to end at 8.48 alright so I'm going to try and get this right but it should it's going to go on in a couple of seconds here there you can see my lights have come on and it started to bake and in 2 minutes the alarm is going to go off so I'm just going to pause and you'll see there when you hit this button it'll tell you when it's going to end so the current time is I'm going to try and jump this down a minute and there the alarm's gone off so that's going to happen you see the lights have gone out I just jumped time back for the sake of the video now very important to remember <clears throat> to cancel the alarm you can press any of these buttons alarm goes off now you can see the A is still flashing and what that means is, is that the oven is still in its automatic mode it's it's powered down it's not going to heat up anymore and if you hit these two buttons to exit the manual mode and kind of go back to manual like so like such because your dials are on and you've exited the timed mode your oven's going to heat back up so it's very important to remember to turn these off if you exit the, the, the timed mode and go to manual. So for all intents and purposes, let's say I wanted to start this in two hours time. I'm going to go start. Um, quickly run this up. What's nice is when you do this and you go to end, it automatically calculates when you're starting. So I'm saying it's going to start at 10.47. I'm going to bake my cookies for 15 minutes to 11.02. I go here, I set it to 300 degrees, and my st you can see it's off. So, as a responsible adult, I'm going to leave the house and go surf. And when I come back, my cookies will have started at the right time, which is two hours from now, which is 10.47, and ended at 11.02, and shut down. And it's going to beep. I come back in the house, I cancel the alarm, and I'm like, okay, I just want to reset the oven. I hit these two buttons to exit the A mode and I'm going to flip these back to zero as well. And there you have it. So manual mode has a little icon. Press this to enter the time and hours and minutes from now. When to start. It's going to add that on to the end time and do your baking for you automatically. Wonderful and very happy so far and I hope this video helped you guys.